We're making some instant ramen. Deluxe version. Let's get into it. You gotta take the nicest bronze pot available to you. It helps with the flavor, I promise. You get the get the ramen. Remove it carefully as to not break it. Place it gently in the delicately in the pot. After you pl delicately place your ramen without breaking it into the bronze fancy pan, put water precisely three fourths of a cup. Precisely three fourths of a cup. Slowly pour your water into the pot. Hey, Chef Kaibak, after carefully putting the water into this very, very immaculate bronze pot, take the flavor packet from your uh, puddle of water and dry it off. Leave that for later. Now this involves some very uh, intense thinking, okay? You gotta, you gotta heat up your oven. I mean, stove. <laughs> You're just gonna turn it as high as it goes, hope that it doesn't like, blow up, right? Then you wait for it to get red hot, very important. The small pot goes on the biggest ring. Yeah. It's Chef Ernie here. Make sure you guys are stirring continuously to make sure it gets as much, uh, you know. Once we get the water up to a boil and you're starting to see some softness in the noodles, then we can do what I like to call straining. But before we do that, when you take the pan off the heater, make sure you turn off the heater. I have a strainer here. Put the ramen in the strainer. Oh, over the sink. Jeff Kai here. Now with your strained noodles, you're just gonna dump them ever so carefully into the bowl. God damn it. Powder flavor packet that you dried off because it was in a puddle earlier. You dump it into the bowl. Ta-da. Now you just mix around your noodles. It looks so good. Ta-da. Jeff Ernie here. Chef Kai here. We thank you guys for watching and how to make a ramen. We hope that you can translate this into the next time you cook. Now for the taste test. Mm, looks good. Bone apple Begin. tea. <laughs> 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 so bad.